County Sheriff's Office is asking residents to keep an eye out for 16-year-old Jordan Smith. The son of one of Maple County's trustees has been missing for three weeks now. He was last seen on October 28th by his co-workers at Tokens Pizzeria on 5th Street, wearing blue jean pants, a white t-shirt, and a red flannel jacket. If you have any information on his whereabouts, please contact the Maples County Sheriff's Office. We will have more information on the story as it becomes available to us. Are you all right? What? Yeah, you don't look like you're feeling uh, bright. I can tell. I I'm sorry. The hell was that about? I have no idea. Do, do you think she wanted to buy one of my jackets? Man, shut the hell up. Nobody wants to walk around looking like a damn disco ball. So, let me get this straight. You're telling me you were chased by a UFO in the sky. Okay, when you say it like that, you must think I'm crazy. I, I wouldn't say that. What are you talking about? Well, last Thursday, around mid-evening, I went out to get the mail. And as I was walking to the mailbox, I heard this loud roaring sound from the sky. I, it stopped me right in my tracks. I quickly looked up, and then this bright blue light just gets cast upon me, just whoosh. I took a few steps back, and that's when I saw it. This giant spherical ship just hovering above me, like it was watching me. I froze and after what seemed like hours I I bolted back into my house. I locked my door and when I looked out my window, it was gone. Holy shit. Yeah. That's that's exactly what I said. So do we do we see the same thing? Well, did your thing look like this? <laughs> then it appears Maples County has some visitors. Where the hell am I? Did you hear that Jordan kid is still missing? Who? 
Jordan Smith, the uh, the mayor's kid, asked. Wow, bro, you are so funny. <laughs> Every time you fall for it. Every time, you never learn. Whatever, man. I'll catch you later. <laughs> hey, kiss your mom goodnight for me. scared about all this? Uh, <laughs> the fact that there are aliens among us trying to take over the human race? Just a little. No, it's just, I don't know. This whole situation just doesn't feel real. Like if you told me a month ago, I'd be at your house discussing theories on why aliens are abducting people from this town, I would think you're delusional. But here I am. I guess the only part of this that feels real is that these creatures took the most important person in my life. We don't know that. For sure. I know he didn't just run away. I have this really bad feeling. I feel like something terrible has happened. Look, three weeks ago, Jordan, the son of our town's trustee, went missing. And soon after, you were almost abducted. I'm not sure I followed. Eric, you're the son of the mayor. Now, I don't think it's a coincidence these aliens have gone after the children of two political figures. In a row, for that matter. But why go after the children? I mean, why not just go for the political figures themselves? Well, that's what I was originally thinking. But consider this. What's the most important thing in any parent's life? Their children? Exactly. So I'm sure once Jordan went missing, his dad was putting all his attention in trying to find him. Which means he's putting less effort towards his job. Now you've got it. So maybe the reason why these aliens are going after their children is so that the people in power let their guard down. Which gives the aliens an opportunity to take over. Precisely. Holy shit. But wait, the aliens went after you. Neither of your parents are political figures. True. But we have to remember, these are highly intelligent life forms. They probably want to mix and match their victims so people don't notice the pattern. But doesn't that contradict everything you just said? Okay, yeah, but that's the best I could come up with. Hey, at least we have a lead. We have a start to a conclusive hypothesis. Hey, I really appreciate you doing this with me. I wouldn't have been able to make it this far without you. Yeah, of course. No problem. Whoa, whoa, Eric, what are you doing? I'm sorry, I thought, you know, we were having a moment, and I just, Eric, I... no. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have done that. Eric, I like you, but just not in that way. Emmeline, I, I think you should leave. Eric! If you stay, something bad will happen, so just... What? Just please leave. What's going on? What happened to you? Evelyn, you need to listen to me. They are here. They are hostile. They work. They're going to take over. This is it. Jordan, Jordan, slow down. Just take it easy. Breathe.
What's going on? Emily, what I'm going to explain to you, you, you will not believe me. Try me. They have arrived, they are territorial, and they are here to stay. Some people of this town are not who they claim to be. They are impersonating people of Maples County. After they took me, I managed to escape. I got dropped in some random field. These creatures, the, uh, the... The aliens. You're talking about the aliens. How do you know about them? I know a lot more than you think. Everything is going to be okay. That I can promise. I'm just gonna need you to stay here and remain calm. I'm gonna go next door and grab Eric and we can all discuss what, it. Wait, did you say Eric? Like Eric Dunham? Yeah, why? Are you kidding me? You don't remember? Remember what? Hey, can you I mean, pause I, it? You know, I gotta go over this bathroom. Yeah, sure. Get your fucking ass over here right now. Hey, man, it, it, it's not what it looks like. Give me this. So, um, yeah, this is stalking. I don't know what you plan on doing with these, but... Well, I was, I was, um, yeah, yeah I was... Uh, I, I, um, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah, that's what I thought. So, I'm gonna ask you to stay the hell away from me and stay the fuck away from M.Y. Do I make myself queer? I said, do I make myself queer? All right, get out of my sight. Keeping this, by the way. You never told me this. I swear I did. But nevertheless, Eric's a bad guy and you cannot trust him. I, I need some air. Hey, Emmeline, are you doing okay? Yeah. What? Hey, stay the hell back. Dunham, I swear to God, stay back. Whoa, 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 I don't want any trouble, man. Just, just calm down, just calm down. Wait, just wait, just give me one second to explain this. <laughs> We are in grave danger! And why should I believe you? <laughs> Attention citizens of Maples County. There have been many sightings of unknown, shape-shifting life forms from the sky, exterminating the people of this state. Until we completely understand the threat, we are issuing a statewide lockdown. We demand you to stay inside and lock all doors and windows. We highly suggest barricading any form of glass windows. As the creatures watch us from the sky, as stated before, these entities have shape-shifting abilities. They could be anybody, anywhere, at any time.
your scheme has created You burn his skin, identity faded Mirror in hand, he's anything but idol This heat withstands in his ever-changing vital when it all began He was so subtle Yet I don't hate this man Perception's a struggle Forced to play this game Cause I can't Cause he can't free